It's a 1964 Park Lane Marauder made by Mercury. The Park Lane model was the top of the line of the three trim levels. Entry level was Monterey, mid-level was Montclair, and top line was uh, Park Lane. And then you had two different roof styles you could have. If it was a fastback, it was a Marauder. If it was a breezeway, then the back actually kicked in at the bottom and the rear window rolled down. Uh, the fastback was to homologate it for NASCAR. And so the flag came with the Marauder. It was on the fenders and it's equipped with a 390 four barrel, 300 horsepower, 427 foot pounds of torque. It has a three speed Mercomatic automatic transmission. It's mounted in the console with the floor shifter, which was actually only an option available on the Park Lane, the top of the line model, which also came with bucket seats. It does have the uh, turn signal indicator in the trim on the front of each fender, in addition to an indicator on the dash as well. Of the Park Lane Marauders, there were 2,721 built in 64. I always liked the 63 and 64 Ford Galaxy Fastback and was actually looking for one for probably a good six months or so. Came across this in the newspaper classified section back in 1999 and went out and looked at, with, uh, looked at it with my dad and ended up buying it. The power steering is very easy to work, so you could literally turn the wheel with one finger. It's, uh, it's definitely different than a modern car, which has sort of graduated power steering. Depending on how fast you're going, it is more or less sensitive. But this, it is full on. I mean, you could easily turn the car into a ditch.